Hello everyone, this is Dark Newt, and welcome back to my Sims 4 Let's Play. So in the last episode, we built our house from the ground up, and now I'm asleep. Um, my guy seems to be pretty tired, and now he's hungry and has to take a tinkle. Um, but once he gets out, out of the way, we will go and visit a public place, maybe the park or a bar. What kind of pee walk? That's a pee pee walk he was just doing there. I feel you, man. When I get up, I have to run to the potty, too. All right, what are we going to cook? Now, I do like how you have a wider selection of food here. So let's make some scrambled eggs. Oh, much better. Now that you got some food in your belly. Now, one thing i got to say about this game, guys, is even though it may not be the most important thing about a game, the graphics do look great. Um, they're not the most detailed or the most realistic, but if you're comparing it to The Sims 3, it definitely looks great. It's a lot smoother. There is more detail in the objects, and it's running great on top of that. You know, I'm getting an easy 60 frames, and I'm really, really impressed, guys, um, by this game so far. But who knows? We have a lot left to experience, so my mind may be changed, but right now I am liking it. Okay, apparently my sim is uncomfortable because of the food he ate. Apparently I didn't make very good food. So before we go out, I was looking at my aspirations here. So since I am a serial romantic, I'm supposed to initiate 10 successful kisses and go on two dates. So it may be a while before we get that done, but we're definitely going to keep that on our mind. Um, because I don't know what happens when you when you get that done. I'm sure you rank up and your aspirations so it looks like my guy also wants to schedule a date but we haven't even met anyone yet so how are we gonna meet people we are going to go out in public because you can't meet people unless you go out in public alright so here we are back on the map now this game isn't open world like the Sims 3 was and a lot of people aren't gonna like it and frankly I'm not a huge fan of it but to be honest, the game does run a lot smoother because it is an open world. Now, I don't know if they couldn't accomplish this level of smoothness with the game being open world. But frankly, it's the way the game is. It's just how it's going to be. So you got to get on with your life. So we are going to head to the park and maybe meet some ladies. It's going to be a good time. All right, so here we are. Now let's go hit up some ladies now I'm sure by the end of the series guys I'm gonna have like 12 kids with 12 different women I don't plan on settling down um, because what's the fun in that also I have a hard time controlling more than one sim so if I get married and I have to control a second sim it's just gonna become very overwhelming okay I said hit up some ladies not are you a, what are you Okay, you're a, you're a really ugly dude. I don't I don't want to talk to you. Where are the ladies at? Apparently, I came on the wrong day. The only lady there is is some old chick. No, thank you. I'm not into that. Ooh, what's over here? I see, I see some, I see some gal. Let's go talk to her. What is your name? Caitlin Humphreys. All right, let's go. Let's go meet her. Hello, Caitlin. So I gave her a, a nice friendly introduction here. So what can we tell her? So we could complain about our problems, but I'm sure she isn't going to like that. So I am a nerd. So let's enthuse about a new show because that's what I like to do because I'm a nerd. All right. Our needs seem to be all right. Okay. So she seems to like like hearing about our show too so she she might be not a bad gal after all so let's let's be friendly now we got to work our way up to a kiss guys that's our goal let's get a kiss out of her acquired a comedy skill bronze new skill in comedy allows him to tell jokes at a microphone and write jokes on a computer oh that's cool so there's a lot more skills in this game there's comedy there's gaming and I think that's pretty cool, but we'll probably look more into that later. I'm still hitting up this girl, um, asking her about her day, you know, making her feel good about herself, and hopefully working up to a kiss. So I'm going to ask her if she's single. Oh, she is. She is single. That's good. We might can might be able to get a kiss out of her. 
That's our goal. Let's do a pickup line here. What kind of pickup lines you got in your arsenal, Braun? You got any good ones? I'm as hard as a statue. Ow. Uh-oh. I'm feeling flirty. Click on a sim and select to ask to be boyfriend. I ain't no. I don't want no. I don't want no girlfriend. Where are you going? Hey, Braun. Come back. What's your problem? You gotta go pee? Not right now, man. We got, we got kissing to do. Come on, don't be doing that. Hey, no. Give her a sexy pose. Do a sexy pose for her. Come here. Okay, so it seems that your your mood reflects some of the interactions you could do, which is kind of cool. Oh, look at that sexy pose. She likes it. So I'm trying to get a kiss out of her. Come on. Blow a kiss. Well, it's not what I was going for, but I'll try that. Confess attraction. Come on, this kiss has to be around the corner. And it better come quick, because I'm about to pee my pants. And I think if I pee my pants, I blow all opportunity for a kiss out the water. Oh, she's attracted to me too. That's good. Okay. First kiss. Here we go, guys. First kiss with some random lady we met at the park, who's actually buffer than me, which is kind of scary. Alright, here we go, guys. Here's the first kiss. And she ran away. Why? No, no, no. It was going to be my first kiss and she left. Aw, rejected. All right, but I can invite her out later on because I do know her. So we will do that. But I better go. I better go potty. Look for frogs. Ooh, I might have to do that in a second. That sounds interesting. But let's, let's go leak the dragon real quick. Do, do, do. All right, so you get your business out of the way, and then we have to catch up with Caitlyn and get our first kiss on. Hey, your bomb. Botch the voice. Are you really flirting with me right now when you're on the toilet? That's kind of funny. So he's feeling flirty, and while he's using the toilet, he's kind of just flirting on. That's that's a little weird, but okay, I could dig that. All right, so let's let's go back to our map. And then when we click on our house, we should have the option to invite someone with us. And we will invite Caitlin Humphreys, our new first kisseroo. Hopefully, hopefully she'll be there. All right, so here she is, our buff, soon to be possibly girlfriend. I don't know if I'm up for for uh, settling down just yet, but let's let's kiss the girl. And get our first out of 10 kisses out of the way. Uh oh, here we go. Ba boom. First kiss accomplished. Now get out. Go away. I don't even care anymore. Ask to leave. Goodbye. Shoo. Sorry, Caitlin. But, but, um, you weren't the one for me. You were too easy. I just met you today. Sorry. There's our next victim. You run by here the same time tomorrow, gal, and I'll snatch you up. Oh, our mailbox is kind of off there. I didn't see it. Okay, so what are we going to do next? It looks like Bronze and I go play The Sims. That's interesting. Let's look at that. So there's quite some inception going on here, guys. So I'm sitting here in the real world watching my Sim, who is watching his Sim. Man, this is getting too deep. Someone call Leonardo DiCaprio. Okay. So, moving on, we need to look for a job because we ain't going to make any money unless we either work the corner or find a job. And I ain't about working the corner, at least not yet. Okay, so we have a lot of jobs here. We have astronaut, culinary writer, tech guru, entertainer. Lots of stuff we can do. Huh. Tech Guru, Career Branches, Esport Gamer. I kind of like that, guys. I'm going to be a Tech Guru and be an Esport Gamer, which, if it's what I think it is, where you play games professionally to make money, I think that'd be really cool. Maybe there'll be, like, land parties and stuff. So let's do that. Okay, so when do we go to work? When's our first, our first work day? 
in 19 hours, so we better get caught up on our moods, get anything done we need to. Go ahead and play some games. Get your web skills up real quick. Play Blick Block. I don't really care what you do, man. Just have fun. Live your sim life to the fullest. Play Tetris. I don't care. Now, guys, I would love to know what you guys think about this game so far. Tell me in the comments. I know a lot has changed with this game. It's been sleeked down. It's been simplified. And personally, I'm okay with that. Um, but I'm sure you guys have a lot to say about it. So tell me in the comments. I'll be sure to reply. I always reply to my comments, guys. I'd love to know what you think about this. So back to you, Braun. I hate to break it to you, but you've been playing games for a few hours and you're starting to stink. So I'm going to have to kick you off there. We're going to hop in the, the bathtub. I don't own a shower. Take a bubble bath. And then I think it'll be time to get a little bit of rest. Well, we still got 18 hours. We'll probably, we may go out and do something real quick or at least play guitar or have fun in the house. So I just saw something interesting. So right in our backyard, we can actually go fishing. So I want to try that out. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's a collectible. Oh, let's let's do that. Get out of the bath. You're clean enough. Let's go explore a little bit. I love collectibles, guys. When I played The Sims 3, I actually had a basement under a garage outside my house. And it was just a room full of collectibles that I had found. And I love collecting these things. Um, so let's go dig this. Oh, there's two. Oh, cool. And then we could go fishing. Go, Braun, go. Get your jog swag on. Oh, this may take quite some time. No, it didn't. Okay, so what do we find? I found some metal Alcron, huh? I wonder if I use that for anything, like sculpting or something. I'm sure we'll find out eventually. What's what's this gonna give us? Oh, I found a fossil. So let's pause the game now. Can I can I access my inventory so we could see what we found here? All right, fossil rock, an ancient deposit of sedimentary rock embedded with odd materials. All right, let's investigate this. So let's extract the fossil. And we found a fossil egg. Fossilized egg, that's cool. So we can we can use that as like a collectible. We could place that somewhere. I'm sure we could sell it. Um, but we could find other things that are more rare. That's pretty cool though. All right, let's let's try out some fishing. Braun learned a fishing skill. Now I'm really liking the fact that they added so many skills. So let's take a look at that. So video gaming, fishing, comedy. Oh man, and I'm sure we discover more as we discover them. So that's really cool that they put more in-depth skills in the game. I really like that. That is really cool. Let's see. Am I going to catch anything? Oh, I caught something. Throw that in my inventory there. A minnow. Can I eat it? No, but I can mount it. Let's name him. Let's name him. Let's name him Snappy Fish. Like the video if you know what Snappy Fish is. Alright. How much time do we got left to, until till work? 16 hours. Now, one thing I noticed about this game, guys, is the time goes by so much slower than it did in The Sims 3. I noticed I can get a lot more done in the time that I have. I don't know. Do you guys think so, too? Tell me in the comments, because I really do think time goes by slower in this game. All right, Braun. So you enjoy your fishing adventure you're on, but I'm going to wrap this episode up, guys. If you want to see more, definitely subscribe, like the video, and stay tuned and I will see you guys next time.